Hey, Gogu, Mrs. Nira used backslash N in the last programming homework. Do you know what it means? Hmm, it's something like go to the next line, but I think Mrs. Nira will explain it nicely. Yes, she is a very nice teacher. Time to sleep, Gogu. Good night. Good night, Adi. Good morning, friends. Good morning, Eve. Good morning. Adi, what's on your mind? You seem to be thinking about something. Yes, I'm thinking about backslash N. Oh, yes. Even I saw my elder sister use backslash T in her program. I'm also curious about backslash in the program. Good morning, kids. Good, Good morning, morning, teacher. teacher. May I ask a question, ma'am? Sure, Adi. What's your question? In yesterday's Python program, we used backslash n. What does it mean and how do we use it? I think you kids are so curious about backslash n. So let me show you. Look, kids, when we want the output to look like this. Here, the output is in four different lines. How would you write the code in Python? We would use four print statements. OK. Good, but Python gives you some tricks. I will make some modifications. That's great. Can anyone guess the use of backslash n? Yes, when backslash n is in the print statement, Python creates a new line. Am I right? Correct, but remember, it must be inside quotes. Each backslash n makes a new line. Ma'am, then what's the meaning of backslash t? It's a tab character. It gives the space of one tab. Let me show you. Wow, it's, it's very, very interesting. interesting. I'll teach you more interesting tricks in Python, but in the next lecture. I will become a Python magician. No, Kaylin, you'll become a programmer. <laughs> Hello friends, today we learned about special characters in Python like backslash n and backslash t. Keep practicing and have fun coding. See you in the next episode.